Hey y'all, welcome to Horse Range Mountain Farm. I'm Nathan, and today we're going to get a swarm of bees out of this house, so y'all come along with us. One of our subscribers got in touch with us and saw our honeybee videos and asked if we'd like to have a swarm of honeybees that were in the wall of his sister's house. So we said sure. So we came over and they were behind the chimney on this house, so we had to start tearing the wall out to get to them. Now this is our first time capturing a swarm of bees, so you experienced beekeepers don't laugh at us too much. We had to remove a section of the siding off of this house to get to the honeybees. Once we removed the siding, we realized that there was more siding underneath, so we had to cut that all out as well. I set the blade on my saw very shallow as to not cut any electrical lines in the wall. swarm was located in this wall behind the chimney in the rock work so it was very hard to get to. I know it's hard to see what I'm doing because my bee suit kind of blends in with the white wall, but we had to rem remove a piece of the top siding as well because the bees had gone a little higher than we thought. when I started to remove this piece of siding that it actually went in behind the chimney so we had to cut it out. finally gained access to the bees and we gave them a little smoke to calm them down a little bit before we started removing them. We had to be very careful pulling the comb out of the opening to make sure we didn't drop any in the wall and potentially lose the queen.
This swarm of bees actually seemed pretty gentle. They weren't very aggressive towards us at all. I removed the honeycomb out of the box that we brought to put the bees in so I could put the frames back in. <laughs> 